Hello everyone, today I'm going to show you how to rip avatars from VR chat in 2024 on Steam. Make sure to watch the video until the end, not to miss any important details. Basically, we have a heads up. So the first thing I can recommend if you plan on ripping people's avatars on a daily basis is setting a quick bar pin in this location. This will be the file that you will save on if you're using Windows. If you're using a MacBook, then you can use a different similar folder destination. How to actually rip. Once you have that folder open, all you need to do is set by date created and the newest one is the avatar you just loaded. So you click on that one and you should see data and info. You want to select the data file and copy it to whatever drive you want to use for ripping. How to get the Unity file. To get the Unity file, you can upload it to your account. It's a bit tricky and will require a basic amount of knowledge in Unity, but you should use an app called Asset Ripper or SARS aka Ares to basically put the file into a Unity pack. How to repair the avatar? Well, the avatar will be broken and probably crash your Unity, so you'll need to find the scripts folder and delete it, which will delete the toggles, but allow you to continue, which is where you, if you have basic understanding of Unity and avatar creation, you can remake the toggles as everything including meshes and sound from the avatar will still be there. How to pick which avatars you want to rip carefully? Some avatars do have safeguards for anti-ripping which can essentially bypass with repair scripts. To pick and choose what you rip and can choose only reveal one person's avatar at a time which will make it easier and to take it more precisely. Now finally, do not by any means use this guy to harass people on VR chat. The only reason I'm making this is so people can regain avatars, they don't have the file or they can get a specific item from the avatar. And that's basically it. Thank you guys for watching. See you next time. Bye-bye.